hello guys welcome back to my channel how are you guys doing in today's video i want to talk about this amazing beautiful talented actress zay etem i love her so much and i love to watch her movies we all know that she has been married for seven years now and in a recent conversation with zay which was held recently at Lekki, she disclosed that she had removed her womb. Talented Nigerian actress Zay Etim, known for her roles in Mr. and Mrs. This is one of her amazing movies. If you haven't watched it, try and watch it. And Phone Swap has revealed why she had to remove her womb in a recent event tagged conversation with Zay, which, were held, which was held recently at Lekki. Speaking in the conversation where she mentioned she was diagnosed of adenomyosis, she said, and I quote, I was told I couldn't have kids and so I had to have a hysterectomy. Hysterectomy is just removal of your womb and removal of your uterus and your uterus is definitely your womb. To make me have a life again and to stop going through what I was going through. And I'm literally telling women and men, it really doesn't matter if you can't bear children. What really matters is what you will do for the world, for the universe. Tears dropped and then my husband squeezed my hand. Yes, she's saying that when they told her, that was three years ago when she was diagnosed with this condition. It's actually a condition where the inner, inner lining of your uterus, the myomectomy, actually the myometrum is actually um, affecting the endometrium. All right. So she said that when she was diagnosed with this condition, adenomyosis, tears dropped down her eyes. Her husband was there with her. The husband squeezed her hand and he was actually reassuring her that there was someone there. You know, there was the, the husband was reassuring her and she felt like there was someone. The husband said, like, this is reality and this is your, re your re reality and you have to deal with it. You know and she said he was telling me that this is reality my reality i didn't think there was any point anymore because my society taught me that i have to be a mother to be appreciated and every time i went online i will have one troll or two say you never born but i'm thankful that that and I, but i'm thankful that that didn't break me i'm thankful for nollywood this is in the atm world anyways guys this is um what she said in the conversation with zay recently at lekki and another thing i want to say is like really our society always um they will put you in this box expecting something for you from you like they will make you to think that you're i don't know if you're a manufacturing machine you can just manufacture things and if you try to follow them really you're going to you you will break down they will break you down that will destroy you totally like and if you look at Zay Etem's story she said um I re in her in her other interviews she didn't mention that before she was diagnosed with this medical condition she has been trying so badly to have children she said she really wanted to have children she loves kids a lot she said she have tried everything she even went from IUI to IVF but everything went to zero it for to no avail it never succeeded and she said she has always wanted to have twins twins boys you know and I, I i really know like i know people will be always saying they'll be saying like when well, she never born why she never born have haven't she put to bed like um she, she got married why is she not giving birth to children you know we have to know that all of us we have everyone has a lot of things going on in their life we have a lot of things going on in our life you know if that word you're going to say is not going to build someone it's not going to add any value in their life please you better don't say it because if you don't if you're not in someone's shoe you really do not know what they're going through so um this is it for today if you haven't subscribed to my channel please do not leave without doing so until then guys i'll see you again in my next video do have a great day bye